It's the time of the year for the rut, as the sambar breeding season is called. A sambar male aggressively guards his territory against rival stags, attracting females by vocal displays and smell. Like most deer, sambar are generally quiet. When alarmed, they stomp their feet and make a rigging call known as pooking or belling. More often than not, it indicates a tiger or leopard is on the prowl. He wallows and digs his antlers in urine-soaked soil and then rubs them against tree trunks. Even standing and marking tree branches with his antlers. Though there is no specific breeding season, it commonly takes place between September and January. For rest of the year, Samba males live alone. But now, surrounded by smaller males with whom he has formed bonds through sparring, a dominant stag defends non-exclusive territory. Sambars are herbivores eating various grasses, foliage, fruits. This one is delirious on bale. A typical sambar herd consists of an adult female, her most recent young and perhaps a subordinate immature female. This is in contrast to other deer like Chital who live in large groups. Samba love undulating terrain. They often congregate near water and are good swimmers. Despite her lack of antlers, a mother will readily defend her young from most predators, which is relatively unusual among deer. When confronted by pack hunting doles, she will lower her head with an erect mane and lash out, preferring to attack in shallow water. Sadly, Samba populations have dwindled due to severe hunting, insurgency and exploitation of habitat, such that they are listed as a vulnerable species on the IUCN Red List since 2008.